Hey guys, I'm back with my May favorites. I know I didn't do my April favorites, but I really didn't have anything new to show you guys. I haven't been like shopping for products a whole bunch lately, besides like hair products. So yeah, um, no April favorites, but I do have a few May favorites. It's not a bunch of stuff. It's like, one, two, three, four. I have nine things to show you, which may sound like a lot. I don't really know, but to me it's like not a lot. Um, I don't know. Anyways, um, so I'm gonna get into that. Oh. First off, actually, my hair, in case you haven't noticed, I got my extensions in today. These are the um, Foxy Locks Clip-In extensions. I just got them in today, and I was so excited to see them in the mail. But, um, but um, yeah, if you guys want to review on these or, like, any of my thoughts on these, then just comment below, like this video, and I will definitely be more than happy to do that for you guys. I wasn't sure if I would because there's a bunch of them on YouTube. Like, if you just YouTube or Google, like, search, um... Foxy Locks Hair Extensions reviews. There's like pages and pages. Um, I didn't think you guys would want to see that, but if you do, uh, I'm more than happy to do a review on it. But anyways, moving on to my first favorite of May. This is actually a NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Iced Mocha. Looks like this, like they always do. And then it's this really super pretty bronzy, goldy, silvery shimmer. Yeah, well... Okay, well, sorry, the camera's not doing it justice at all, but it's seriously gorgeous. My favorite go-to eyeshadow right now, like, whenever I want to just do a quick, like, two-minute thing, it's this all the way. So, um, I actually have a few of these jumbo eye pencils, but I don't use them all. I really just use this one the most. I'm obsessed with it. I'm going to go buy, like, five more because this is obviously, like, running out. Like, there's, like, no tip left. So, that's the first thing that I'm absolutely just obsessed with. And then my next thing is also from NYX, and it's the Slide On, Glide On, Stay On, and definitely a Turn On Waterproof Extreme Shine Eyeliner. <laughs> yeah, super long name, right? But um, this is in the color Purple Blaze. It's the same color as the um, packaging, actually. And I kind of ruined it. It's like that. It's a little pencil. I kind of ruined it when I sharpened it because it was running low. So I'm going to buy another one of these, too. But um, I've been loving just putting this on my upper lash line and then doing like a little bit of shimmer in the inner corner with like a silver color and just some mascara and going it looks so cute so whenever I don't do this I do this it's like awesome product from NYX and they're so super cheap they're always like buy one get one half off at Ulta so if you have an Ulta and you want to try these out go and they're like five dollars and four dollars something like that and you get them buy one get one half off so like winning Okay, so the next thing that's on my favorite list for May is a new mascara, actually. Not the orange one, which I still am obsessed with, still love it, but um, I wanted to try another one. So this is by CoverGirl, and it is the Lash Perfection, La Lash Perfection Mascara. And it, the brush just looks like this. A pretty basic brush, I don't know. But it's like, I don't know what it is, it really just gets your lashes and like just pulls them, like... It separates them so nicely, and it really just, you know, you can see all of your lashes for once. And the only thing I don't like about it is that it does, it isn't a super volumizing mascara. Like, it's kind of more focused on length and, like, separating your um, lashes more than, like, making them thick and black and, like, pow. But, um, I've still been loving them. It looks so pretty on. Um, this is a really good mascara if you want to try something new. Okay, so my next makeup favorite is actually a bronzer. Sorry, my like things are rolling around. Um, is a bronzer from Too Faced and is the Chocolate Soleil Matte Bronzing Powder. It's a mini sample size. My friend actually gave it to me. She works at Ulta. Uh, thanks, Tay. But uh, yeah, so it's a matte bronzing powder. I'm sure you guys all know about it. Um, it smells like freaking chocolate, which is always a winning. Yeah, it smells like hot chocolate or something like oh so good so yeah I know I just use this to contour my cheeks a little bit and like under my jawline so I also like this um I'm not sure if I buy the whole big size of it because I think it's like $30 or something and that's kind of intense for like a bronzer but I don't know we'll see how long this lasts me and how much I end up loving it by the end of it and then I will let you guys know if I'm gonna repurchase it or not but until then loving it Okay, so my next beauty favorites are, these are like hard to hold, are the EOS Lip Balms. Yay! I love them. I have a bunch now. Um, if you guys saw my What's My Purse video, I only had the yellow one in my purse, and I had the mint one also, but 
um, I said the yellow one sucked. And, uh, so I went to Ulta a few days ago and I got two more. And that is in the pink and the green. And this is in honeydew and strawberry. So now I have four and I'm obsessed with them and I use them like all the time. Like this is the only lip product I pretty much use. Whoa, they just flew. <laughs> yes. Anyways. Um, yeah, these are the only lip products I really use in summertime. I don't really care about having my lips all done up. And plus, being home, I'm with my boyfriend more and he doesn't really like, uh, you know, lipsticks and lip gloss on because he, like, gets on him or whatever. So, yeah, I just have been using these. He likes these. I like them. They taste good. They smell good. And they are super moisturizing. So, yes, these are definitely great. Okay, my next and last beauty favorite. Um, I have, like, three random favorites coming up. Anyways, my last beauty favorite so far is the Bath & Body Works Aruba Coconut Triple Moisture Body Cream. And it looks like this. Um... They have this whole new like summer line out and they have all these awesome smells and this is one of the scents that I'm obsessed with. Seriously, Aruba Coconut and then Bali Mango are my favorites and I got them both in this big thick cream. But I've been using this one the most. I had this in my purse. I have it in my purse now and mm, it smells so good. It smells like kind of a citrusy tropical fruit. Barely any coconut, which is kind of weird that they call it coconut, and I usually like things that are coconut, um, not like just Im imposters kind of, but whatever, this smells really, really good, so I definitely recommend this if you like tropical summer scents, go and check this out. It smells amazing, and I have it in like all the different forms, like I have the spray mist, I have this, and I think I have the sh shower scrub, body scrub, whatever. Awesome, love it all, so this is also a great thing to have. Okay, so my... First non-beauty favorite of May is actually my Nook. Yes, I got a Nook. I caved in. If you guys know me, you know that I just love reading. I love reading so much. I love books, magazines, all that. And I, when the Nooks and like Kindle started coming out, I was like, that's so stupid. Like, I want to just buy books, have the actual paper in my hands, turn the pages and everything. But as I was at school and coming home and stuff and like flying back and forth, it just kind of got inconvenient to be carrying around books with me and like magazines and stuff and my bags my bags would get really heavy and it was kind of obnoxious and I didn't like that when I would finish a book I have to like run to Barnes and Noble right away to get a new one like yeah it was exciting but it was kind of obnoxious at the same time so to avoid that I caved in and got a nook this is my case for it and here it is in here ah it's actually the nook color and um it was on sale for Mother's Day for like a hundred and forty dollars hundred and twenty dollars something like that something in that range so it really wasn't bad, and then I just got this really cute case for it with a super cute quote on it, and it says, women are meant to be loved, not to be understood, and it's by Oscar Wilde, and I just thought it was so cute, and it's pink, so yeah, that's awesome, loving my nook. i um, actually reading right now, I am reading Steve Harvey's Act Like a Lady, Think Like a Man, and it's so funny, and I love it, so yeah, let me know if you guys are reading that too, because it's really good, and if you saw the movie let me know I'm super obsessed with it so my next non beauty favorite is actually jewelry and it is earrings I have been completely obsessed with earrings lately like I've been buying them constantly every time I go somewhere shopping I'm buying earrings like literally yeah it just doesn't stop and I just got these also they're like little spikes yeah I've been buying earrings at the wazoo it's really crazy but I'm obsessed. I think they're like the best jewelry items you can really have. Are really cool, super pretty. Hi, Penny. My dog just came downstairs. But, oh. oh she's freaking out because there's like a storm outside. But, look at her. Hi. She's out. She's really fat. Okay. And now my other dog's coming over. Okay. Alright. Anyways. But yeah, so earrings. I'm obsessed with them. Loving them right now. And my final favorite of the month had to be a food of course and it is actually pretzel crisps Take that off. pretzel crisps I'm obsessed with them I've been eating these so much seriously I have them with like all of my lunches like I'll have like a sandwich and then I'll have to get like a handful of these they're so good I'm pretty sure they're like low fat and better for you than like chips obviously and other like full pretzels and what they look like well, I'll show you guys they're kind of new. They have a bunch of other flavors now. They have like eight flavors. 
But I really like the original ones the best. It's a broken one. Okay. There's kind of like these really super flat pretzels. Like, do you see how freaking thin it is? Like, ah, but they're so cute. They're so good. So, yeah. Me and my mom have been loving them. I, like, got them. I made her get them at Target, and she was like, those are going to be gross. You're not going to like them. And I was like, no, trust me, they're good. And now she's obsessed with them, too, and we've gone through, like, three bags. So, yeah. I think that's the end of my favorites for me. I told you it would be super quick. I didn't have a bunch of stuff, but I did have some really good things that I'm obsessed with right now. And I really wanted to show you guys. My dog is trying to, like, go by this little ladder right now. She's freaking out. I'm going to go and save her. But, um, anyways, if you guys like this video, then subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button. And comment below and let me know what your my favorites are. If you have any recommendations for me to try out things. And, um... I don't know, anything that you really want to say. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.